Hello, bonjour, buenos dias. Hello and welcome to the Modern Foreign Languages French and Spanish GCSE presentation. We hope you will find the following information useful and inspiring. Give yourself the edge. They did. You may be surprised to learn that quite a few celebrities have degrees in languages, including the following. J.K. Rowling. Paula Radcliffe. Lucy Liu. Jonathan Ross. Rory Bremner. Fiona Bruce, Chris Martin, and Nigella Lawson. All of these have degrees in languages. So why study French or Spanish at GCSE? Well, languages are really important in the world we live in and give you great skills for the rest of your life. Whether for business, travel, or just using the internet, knowing a foreign language is a vital skill for life, enabling you to communicate more effectively, complete translations from English into the target language, get to grips with basic grammar. You can find out about the way of life in different countries, and you can learn how to learn a language. They'll also give you a solid foundation so you can use the language if you visit the country in the future. And not least, you'll be able to talk to the locals in the French and Spanish countries you visit. So the course content is laid out here and we have three themes studied at GCSE. In year nine, you have actually already begun the GCSE foundation year and years 10 and 11 build upon the skills you are already developing. As I said, the topics to be studied include three themes. Firstly, covering identity and culture, including topics such as family, friends, technology, free time, customs and traditions. The other two themes cover local, national, international and global areas of interest and current and future study and employment. Many of these topic areas we have already touched upon in years seven to nine and all look to build upon and develop your fluency in the language. As for the exam, well, the four skills of listening, reading, speaking and writing are equally weighted at 25% each and all are assessed in an exam at the end of year 11. All four skills are practiced and developed during lessons and through home learning. You will be familiar with these course textbooks that you are currently using in year nine. And indeed, we continue to use them in year 10 and 11 in French and Spanish. They are part of Pearson, whose active learn website you will have also seen and used. The active learn website is an excellent way of allowing you to practice the four skills of listening, reading, writing and speaking. We use this in class and can assign you tasks to do independently at home. The other much loved platform is Linguascope and this offers beginners and more advanced vocabulary and grammar practice tasks. And this will feature too at GCSE. Now, it may seem that everyone speaks English, but in fact, 75% of the world's population do not. There are many key careers and fields of work where languages play a very important part. For example, in hospitality and tourism, publishing and media, education, recruitment and human resources, law, advertising and marketing, to name just a few. The list is not exhaustive as there, as there are many other professions and jobs where the ability to communicate in another language is seen as a key advantage. Give yourself the edge. This is what a top employer said he is looking for in a new employee, including social skills, teamwork, communication, problem solving, 
confidence, experience, open-mindedness and flexibility. All of these can definitely be advanced and enhanced by having a foreign language on board. Learning languages certainly gives you these skills and speaking another language definitely makes you stand out from the crowd. They also said that today business is global, that English is important but not enough and that foreign languages are vital if you'd like to get noticed more overseas. So languages are really, really important. And the internet has brought everybody much closer together. So chatting, blogging and networking with people of different languages from all over the world is more important than ever. And those skills at the bottom are ones that are definitely enhanced by having a language on board, listening, cultural awareness, creating strong relationships and networking becomes easier if you know the language. We'll leave you now with a bit of information on us as a staff here at Kingsbridge Community College. We hope you will enjoy reading them and hope they will further inspire you to choose either French or Spanish at GCSE. Thank you for listening and we look forward to seeing you soon. Merci, au revoir, gracias, adios.